praise the Lord. It's yet another time uh, that we are coming in uh, to have this fellowship yet again uh, with you tonight, uh, the Samuel's Ambassadors for Christ. And today we are blessed to come along with our children. They will be uh, ministering to the Lord with a, a song or two as we prepare the ground to engage in our fellowship tonight in the name of Jesus Christ. So we will welcome you in the mighty name of Jesus. And uh, before we move on, allow me to do a word of prayer as we uh, will be welcoming my wife also to greet you uh, before we call in the Samuels ambassadors for Christ. Let us pray. Father, we want to thank you for your goodness for yet another evening that you have given to us. Uh, we want to continue, uh, oh Lord, lifting your name because this is what you have called us to do. And uh, we pray for your grace and anointing that Jehovah, we may be able to sensitize uh, the parents of this day that they may know is their responsibility to raise a godly offspring because this is what you ordained from the beginning, Lord. Give us the wisdom, give us the grace, and give us the understanding. We pray this, trusting in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Ma, maybe you can introduce wow. our theme today yeah. uh, uh, as we are ministering in this fellowship in Jesus' name. Wow, good evening. Thank you for tuning in. Maybe others are tuning in from uh, different countries. Could be in the morning. Uh, and we are gathered here just to contact for our families, for our children. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Tell us where you're tuning from. Tell us whether our voices are clear. We are going to try as much as possible to lift up our voices yes. so that we may be able to communicate with you. It is uh, our pleasure. We thank the Lord for allowing us this time. We never take anything for granted because we know God has considered this for our good. And before we move on now, allow me to welcome the Samuels so that they may join us to continue from this point in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. 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 Welcome. Welcome the Samuels. Karibuni. Karibuni sana wanja ni wenu the summers karibuni Amen 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 uh, We are going to do a few worship songs just yes. to exalt the Lord the name of the Lord Amen and to welcome his presence even as we are standing in the gap for our families and for, for the sake of the children Yes Amen. So Christian Are you down for me for
So grateful because of you, the Samuels, and now uh, I would like to dismiss you for this hour as we continue with Mom in Fellowship. Yes. We may call you back God if you need you. God bless you, you so much, you. the Samuels, and we love you. Hallelujah. Yes. Amen. Thank you, Father. We thank you for this moment. Uh, the people who are watching. Yes, please. Elizabeth, Elizabeth, hope you are for our children. Amen. We are more than you. Amen. God bless 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 you. Amen. 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 Uh, are there others you are appreciating so that we may get in mm. the next time? Uh, Elizabeth, uh, yeah. Nyamwe, Nyamwe, Nyamwe is with us. Nyamwe. Join us, join us and let us contend, let us pray, let us stand in the gap on behalf of our children. Amen, amen. Yeah, we can do something. We are not helpless. Hallelujah. We are not helpless. Amen. The days are wicked, the enemy has stolen. Our children, you remember the story you were sharing with me? Yes. What has happened? Yes. But we are not hopeless. Amen. We are not helpless. Amen. God is on our side. Hallelujah. And if God be for us, who, who can, can be, be against us? us? We shall plead for mercy. Amen. We shall plead for forgiveness. Amen. Where we have failed to take our position as parents. Position of, position of being responsible. Amen. Our God is merciful. Amen. And we're going to promise him that we are going to arise and take up our position amen. as parents. Amen. 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 That is the, the word of encouragement and we want to encourage ourselves. As David also encouraged himself in the Lord when he was at the point of breaking down. And the Lord gave him a word that brought about victory in his life and he was able to salvage and save uh, his wife and the, the people who have been taken captive with all the possessions our God is able to fight for us and restore even that which the enemy has stolen oh, from yes. us and uh, as the scripture says in the book of Jude that I am writing this to remind you it's not that you do not know mm -hmm. I am writing this to remind you of uh, of what is the word of the Lord uh, uh, concerning us in at this point. So we're sharing this to remind ourselves of our position, where we are coming from, where we are, and where we are going in the Lord. Amen. We, we, Somebody say, yes, we please. To that lady. Yeah. Uh, Saudi is cutting off. Yeah, we, we, we have been having a challenge of network for quite some time. And we believe uh, we will get there. Where we and you know get, when we are uh, doing that thing, it's not cutting. It's yes, only cutting we, we when we are coming like... Sure, we have actually been having a challenge. Mm. 
and uh, we think we are flowing but uh, the voice is, is not consistent but we, we believe a time will come when we will be uh, having proper equipments to do this ministry that's why we are requesting you that you put us in prayers that the Lord may also make a oh, provision yes. for the necessary equipment because we know it's our time to release this grace for families yes. and we believe uh, in the will of God also and uh, uh, by his hand all things shall be uh, fulfilled to the expectations in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Uh, I would like us to remind ourselves right from the beginning what when God created man, the, the man and the woman. And this is what we're finding in, a, in Genesis chapter 1 verse uh, 28 precisely. The Lord blessed the man and the woman and, and, and mandated them to go multiply and subdue. Amen. 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 So we see right from the beginning mm -hmm. This was the mind and the command of God concerning mankind. And uh, when we move further in the scriptures, we will see for sure God intended that uh, man may reproduce and fill in the earth with a godly offspring, mm -hmm. God-fearing children, God-fearing people. Amen. Uh, but we see it never went far before the enemy managed to strike. And that, that, that point was somehow destroyed. Uh, but we thank God because he's usually able to restore the restoration that he has brought through our Lord Jesus Christ. We see uh, even the, the, the will of God uh, being uh, uh, demonstrated or elaborated throughout the scriptures concerning families. Malachi 2, the Lord emphasizes saying, he brought the man and woman together because he desired a godly offspring. Okay. Mm -hmm. you know, in our fellowship today, God has uh, graced us with, uh, with what we have been praying for, for the first ever uh, meeting that we did today during the day here in Fika. Mm -hmm. And we are planning to do next in, in Kirinyaga County, also in Nairobi. We thank God for those people that God is awakening, the parents that God is awakening, mm -hmm. and they are organizing meetings, and uh, we pray that we will be able to go in their places and Amen. minister, empowering the parents mm. that they may stand in their position of authority oh, to yes. execute this original mandate that was given to, uh, to man by God since the beginning. Amen. So we thank God for what has happened today in Fika. We thank God for what will be happening uh, in the near future in Kirinya County and also Nairobi as we move on. Uh, wherever you are and you feel you would, we, we need to do this to impart and empower parents mm -hmm. concerning the family altar and parenting. You can reach to us and we sit and organize. When you have just a group of a few parents, we don't mind, we will come in. We are not looking for numbers, but a place to deposit the seed of God. Amen. Amen. So come up. We are calling on families. Come up. Uh, servants of God, you who have a burden for families, come up. Let us join and make this um, army even greater that we may retrieve our children and our families mm -hmm. uh, back to God mm -hmm. from where they are right now. For we bear witness the enemy has managed to steal our children. Mm -hmm. Because if our children are not serving God, let us not lie to ourselves. They are serving another master. Mm -hmm. But this is not the reason for which God created them. And we are saying we are not going to make our houses brood of uh, 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 brooding a place to brood vipers we are refusing we will raise children for our God Amen. in the name of Christ our, children, will serve our, God. our children are going to serve God this is what our we are standing are for, for signs and wonders hallelujah uh, Psalms 127 that Amen. Uh, behold children are a heritage from hallelujah. the Lord yes. and the fruit of the womb is our is a reward Amen. like arrows in the heart of a warrior so are the children of one's youth. Amen. 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 And happy is the man who has his quiver full of them. Amen. They shall not be ashamed, Hallelujah. but shall speak with their enemies in the gate. Amen. This is the promise of God. Hallelujah. As a, uh, 
concerning our children. Amen. So we must stand on God's promises. Amen. 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 And let us arise and do our part. God will do his part. It's the only mistake that we are doing is that parents we have neglected. Uh, uh, we've been busy doing other things. Yes. And the enemy has clipped in and uh, stolen our children. But if we stand, I seek for forgiveness from our Father. He's a merciful God. Amen. He's a merciful God. He will forgive us. He will forgive us. If we repent sincerely in, uh, from our hearts, our God will forgive us. Amen. We, we, we turn from the ways that we are walking in. Uh, uh, many of us, uh, I want to speak this, uh, many of us actually have veered off the path and have steered far away uh, from the path. But let me tell you, it's never too late. It's never too we late. can get back on the yeah. path and move on and accomplish the mandate for which uh, a God created man. And that you were telling me about even grandparents. Elizabeth has a granddaughter. Amen. She's telling me that she's telling us that uh, she moves around saying, Jesus, Jesus. Yes, that's the way. Amen. Let them, when they're speaking, let them speak Jesus. Hallelujah. Actually, this calling I've been emphasizing yeah. so much. Uh, this is parenting and grandparenting. Yeah. Even great grandparenting. Yes. If you're there and you're mm. still energetic continue sowing seed yes the seed of god in mm. your children in your grandchildren and in your great grandchildren it shall not go to waste for we know god testifies about abraham mm. for i know abraham he will teach his children the ways of righteousness and justice and 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 the ch his children his children children and the children to come which means as long as you're here and you're living and you're able to do it parent and grandparent when you come to our children who are parents, you find they still need your counsel because you are carrying wisdom and this wisdom, let it not just go to waste, let us put it, uh, uh, sow it again and again yes. until we realize Naomi, that. Now, Mikinyanjui is saying that our kids will serve God. Amen. Hear our prayers, O oh Lord. Yes. Hallelujah. We will say like Joshua. Yes. As for me and my household, yes. we shall serve the Lord. Joshua, Hallelujah. Kero, Joshua Kero Gamake, eh? Aketa. Joshua Kero Gamake, ta. Nie na nyumba ya kwa yode. Joshua Kero Gamake, ta. Nie na nyumba ya kwa yode. Tule tunga tagera ngai. Ona nyode muare ngai. No troga te mut. You will not. You we will are not, not going because to our, our, our God is gracious. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes, we will Amen. serve the Lord with our young Lord. and, and with, with our, our old. In the name Amen. Of Jesus. Amen. For the glory and honor of our Father. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We were sharing uh, during the day, and uh, there are some critical, there are some critical truths that we must speak. If God created man uh, to propagate this godly offspring, and uh, a time comes when in the world they are found none, what do you think the Lord will do? Because we know uh, uh, the scripture says a, a, a tree that is not producing mm. is on the verge of being cut down. Jesus also said we are the salt of the world. If, if the salt loses its taste, it is of no use. It is as good as, uh, as the soil that is thrown and trampled upon. Amen. We must not light our lamps and put them under the table. We must rise and let us shine for the Lord. Amen. If we lose all these virtues, we may find ourselves in that position when God regretted why he created man. And he had to wipe mankind from the face of the world. Mm. Uh, let's not reach that point. Let us arise now. Uh, well, there is still a light to mm -hmm. walk and see ourselves before darkness catches up with us mm -hmm. and we turn back to the path. It, it is not a big thing, just uh, beginning with where you are and what you are able to do. Uh, we were speaking yesterday about pray for a meal with your children, mm -hmm. pray when you're going out, pray mm -hmm. when you come back. Mm -hmm. Uh, uh, show them to thank the Lord when they receive even gifts from you, from, from grandpa, wherever it is. Mm. Let them uh, cultivate that culture of thanksgiving. Mm. And, and as you pray with them, you know what will happen? 
faith will develop in them. And when they have faith from their heart, they will have love for God. Yeah. And when they have love for God, they will be committed to Him. Yes. And from that commitment, service and ministry will come out. Amen. This is how virtue extracts itself from the life of a child as your fellowship, as you are uh, involving them in that family altar. We have seen this with our children. Today, we, we, we never push them. We don't push them. They, they freely do the ministry and the work of God because we do our part and the rest God will do. Yeah. Uh, today, our children will just gather and, and bring about opinions among themselves. Finally, we see great ministry moving. Even today, they walked out, they minister to other children, they do all these things, and we are seeing a change coming to other children through our children. So right. let us be intentional in doing this. Let us not deny our God that chance because he says he's in need of these children. Yes, as Kabolo says, me and my son, Hallelujah. we will serve the Lord. Amen, Glory amen. Glory to God. Hallelujah. We are not leaving them behind. Yes. You know, you remember how Pharaoh was negotiating with Moses? Yes. What was he telling uh, Moses? Pharaoh, Pharaoh uh, began negotiating with mm -hmm. Moses and said, oh, you want to go and worship? Let men alone go. Mm -hmm. Okay, you, you you will go with, with, with this and you leave your livestock, you go and then come back. But Moses stood firm and said, no, we are going with our old and our young, Amen. with our sons and with our daughters, with our flocks and our cattle. They, they were to leave nothing behind. As a matter of fact, even they were added a, a gold and, 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 and all this, so that they may be equipped and they may be uh, in possession of things they can offer. Uh, to God. Even today, this is the freedom that God has intended. Mm -hmm. We may be struggling in some areas, but let me tell you, because we are still on a path of acquiring all that mm -hmm. is ours. Our children must be released by the hand of Pharaoh. Hallelujah. Our sons must be released Hallelujah. by the hand of Pharaoh. Oh, yes. Our daughters must be released Amen. by the hand of the Pharaoh. We're declaring Jesus. this. Oh, yes. Our possessions must mm. be released. Yes. As a matter of fact, even mm. God will cause us to loot from the kingdom of Amen. darkness. Glory to because God. all things belong to God. And as the scripture says, all things belong to us. We belong to Christ and Christ yes. belongs to God. Amen. He is our father and he is a possessor of all these things. Yes. And these things are there for us. Yes. The devil may have stolen them now, including our children, including our household fellowships. Mm. But we are going for them. We are contending for them. Oh, yes. We must bring them oh, back. Oh, yes. In the name of in Jesus In the name Christ. of Jesus Christ. Yes. Because power has been granted to us. Yes. And God is on our and side. And God is on and our he's side. he's telling us that the battle belongs to him. Hallelujah. What do we have to fear? Hallelujah. Let us not fear and let us arise. And be intentional. Amen. Do things in, you know, being intentional. Amen. You know, when we're doing business, you are very uh, keen. keen because you want to make profits. You yes. want to see the business uh, growing, Hallelujah. growing. So it's the same even with our children. Let us see. You know, we, we want our children to study well, to be good in class, yes. feed well, dress well. Where is the place of God? Mm -hmm. Are we mindful about our, the spiritual part? About our children, this is where uh, we need to really put emphasis because even if we do all other things and we push God away, we ignore God. Let me tell you, we are not. Whatever we sow is what we are going to reap. And, we, and and like we are watching, we are we can see what is happening even in our country. Bad things are happening to our children. We have raised children. Now parents are just crying. We are crying. What have we done? Where have we gone wrong? We have done things wrongly. There's somewhere we have missed. And this is where now we need to get back to the path, Dad. And, and rectify. And rectify. Let us not mm -hmm. lose hope uh, as the children of Israel did yeah. when they were walking in the wilderness. Uh, Deuteronomy uh, chapter 1 verse 39. And the Lord was angered and he said, And for your children whom you said, they shall be taken captive in this wilderness. Mm -hmm. Them I have given to enter the land. God is so much interested in these children. Let us stand as good stewards so that we give them the lead. But if we are not in that position, then 
it is an issue we, with us parents. We must stand fast in that position of obedience to our Amen. Father so that we may also teach obedience to our children. So yeah. let, 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 us, let us humble before the, the mighty hand of, of God and He will lift us. Let us, let, let us uh, appreciate uh, the fact that uh, when we have done wrong, we are easily accepting and uh, repenting and saying sorry to God. Because always His arms are wide open waiting for us to come back like prodigal sons. We must also but we thank God for his grace that caught up with us and here we, now, we are now and seeing the manifestation of the wisdom of God. When we obey, uh, we shall eat of the fruit of the land Amen. and we shall not lament of the evils that are catching up with the world and especially concerning our children. When we fail to establish them in godliness, when they go out there, they are, they are encountering some other wisdoms. Let me tell you, we do some very, very uh, grave mistakes. Uh, when we say, yes, I know God ordained salvation to be of families. We can peruse the scriptures and we see so many scriptures attesting to that. But we parents are saying, okay, we are now in a different society, civilized society, let people make their own decisions. You leave your child without the seed of God until the age of 18 for them to make a decision by themselves who what will they compare with they have already been swallowed with the wisdom of the world mm -hmm. they will make arguments uh, that are not standing but if you have sown the seed of god since childhood before even they reach to those ages they will have made decisions long ago to serve this god Amen. the god of 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 their parents so let us not take this issue for granted. The wisdom of God teaches us as you teach your child the ways of God. And when they grow up, they will never depart from Amen. it. We need to do that. Uh, from uh, We were discussing some other times with my wife and I was asking her. I was so much shocked because we, we have brought up all those children you are seeing. But it was like I was hearing it for the first time. At what age are you supposed to begin teaching your child? She said to me, uh, as little as six months. Yeah. When will a six months old understand what you're teaching? She told me, let them try to bite the nipple when they're they circling. Yeah. They bite you, yeah. chuna. Tomorrow yeah. they will not do that. What does that mean? They are learning from as little as last age. Parenting begins at those tender ages. And as they grow, I'm telling you, they will be compatible to the wisdom of God. Amen. They will be made what the Lord intended them to be made. Amen. There is much we need to talk about parenting. Parents, let us not take these things for granted. Mm -hmm. uh, the word of the Lord, this is a, 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 a tested equipment to shape the destiny of our children. Yes. It is tested and proved to be right and lacking nothing. If you want to shape the life of, of your child, this is an, uh, a shipping equipment that is approved in the name of Jesus. Amen. You Hallelujah. can have the summers and they do a number. Summers. Hallelujah. We want to invite the summers back and uh, let the us summers. continue. Uh, uh, let us continue uh, talking, commenting, interacting. And we also say uh, this ministry does not end online. If you feel like the, there is an issue you want to share with us, you can still share. Even in, in, in confidence, we can uh, still discuss off air. And if you don't mind on air, we'll still discuss it and uh, pray over these issues because uh, we are determined to break the shell that is uh, 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 holding our children. And we must uh, loosen them uh, for the service of our God in the name of Jesus. Amen. the Samuels. Amen. Amen. Okay. There is a name above all
a lovely name of Jesus. Lovely in heaven, lovely on earth, even underneath. For with this name, this name has authority. There is no any other name by which men are saved. And with this name, there is authority that is delegated to us by our God in the name of Jesus Christ. Exodus chapter 10, verse 2. Yes. Uh, it reads, the Lord says, That you may tell your children and grandchildren how I dealt harshly with the Egyptians and how I performed my signs among them, and that you may know that I am the Lord. The Lord does not want us to hide these things to our children. Because when we share with them of the workings of God and wondrous works of God, what we have achieved from our God, we share with our children. This will be a, 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 a sunk in the hearts and it will be a testimony to them tomorrow and encouragement and something to build their faith as they are walking their faith, their walk of faith, even when we shall be long gone. So Amen. let us share with our children the things of God. Amen. We may, must not look at them as delicate vessels. Let me tell you, God is interested in them. He wants to use them in their feeble nature. And we have seen this happening. Children will intercede for your ministry. Mm -hmm. They will intercede for the issues that are affecting the entire family. Amen. Let it be those arrows that we have shared with the word of God, that they may return all battles at the gate in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Amen. So we are winding up as we are winding up, and we want to engage uh, uh, with prayers, the, the last prayer as we are winding up, we, because our families must be loosed, and our children must be loosed. Whatever bondages they have been entered with or without knowledge, mm. either through our actions mm. or whatever it may be out there, we are engaging in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Psalms, I want us to lift this prayer together by faith to release our friends that are out there that are oh, in yes. bondage in the name of Jesus the Christ. Oh Jesus Lord Christ. God Almighty. Yes. God of heaven and earth. Hallelujah. By your wisdom, you have created the heavens and the Yes, Father. And you have given a command that no man can break. Yes. And we know for sure this is your will. Oh, yes. Today Lord. we are standing on behalf of families. Yes. And we are declaring yes. the bodies that are binding yes. our children. Mm. We declare them broken. In the name of Jesus. We declare your anointing that breaks every yes, yoke. Lord. Children, we call you out. Yes. Of the bonds that you are in, yes. in the name of Jesus yes, Christ. In the name of we Jesus. are calling you into freedom yes. of our Lord Jesus yes. Christ. We are declaring oh, that the Lord heavens may God. hear. We are Lord declaring that God. the earth may hear. Yes. That yes. this is a decree of our God concerning you. Yes. That he created you so that you may serve him. Amen. In the name oh, of Jesus. Jesus. We are breaking every yoke. Yes. Every fetters. Yes. Every handcuff. Yes. Every chains yes. that the enemy has loaded in you, with or without your knowledge, yes. we are breaking loose and we are setting you free yes. to the service of our God in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Every covenant that you have entered, yes. with or without knowledge, yes. we are raising against it. Yes. In the name of Jesus Christ, Amen. we are declaring the wisdom of God yes. and the ultimate art, yes. which is the cross of our Lord Jesus Christ. Yes. We are declaring the sacrifice of the cross, who is none other, our Lord Jesus Christ. Yes. We are declaring the most precious blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. And we are declaring that altar to speak to every altar that is holding you, because this is an eternal covenant that we are entering with the God of all gods, oh, yes, God Lord. of all creation, yes, in the name of Jesus Christ. Yes, Lord. Oh Lord, help our parents to yes. melt their hearts and our children to melt their hearts, oh Father, that yes, they may Lord. receive this word from you yes. in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. We are declaring to the ravines, yes. to the valleys and mountains, yes. and oceans, we yes. are declaring yes. even to the coastal regions, yes. may this word resound and vibrate. Amen. 
and shake the whole earth today yes for the glory and honor of our father in the name of jesus christ yes let it be heard in every household yes let it be heard in every congregation yes let it be heard in the heart of all men yes in the name of jesus christ oh lord we plead for mercy because of all that we have not done that was yes we plead for mercy because of what you want to do. Renew your masses for us Renew this master, day, Lord. this morning, in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Lord, we thank you for your faithfulness and masses and goodness. For we pray this trusting in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. 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 Glory, Amen. To, God. Glory to our Father. Yes. As we are winding up, and we thank you, Lord. Amen. And we thank you, God, for every family that is represented here. And even those that are not with us online, we still speak this grace to you. Amen. In the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. I, I want to thank God because of the work that he has done today mm. uh, as I told you we had a very nice and powerful fellowship here on parenting and family altar and we have seen the hand of God delivery Amen. let me tell you it, it is the will of our father to lose us to lose families you are there you have an issue concerning family mm-hmm. yeah. uh, l- let us look upon the lord let us come together and yes. pray and i know let me tell you this is not even an issue of 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 like uh praying and struggling and doing all that in the midst of our fellowship god is descending and delivering yeah. we have witnessed those works today yeah in the, in our meeting we have and we glorify god we thank yes. god for what he's doing mm. it is his will hallelujah amen 
Don't take this moment for granted. Yes. You are there and your heart is willing to bring up an offspring for God and you do not have a, 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 you are not married. We want to declare these counsels before God. Yes. We we pray strategically. Yes. Or we speak strategically as yes. Hannah did. Yes. And God will bring these blessings our way. Amen. We want to see these things happening. Yes. By the hand of our God. And it will happen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hapa kuna neema. Kuna neema. Kuna neema. Neema kubwa. Kutoka kwa mungu. Freely he has given. Freely you will receive in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. For the glory and honor of our God. Hallelujah. Amen. Ma'am, what do we have to see? But to thank our God because of his faithfulness Amen. and goodness. Hallelujah. Amen. Hemuridi. Hemuridi. Hallelujah. Hemuridi. Watikile murata. Akinita woko.
decided to follow Jesus. Amen. Amen. Have you decided? Yes. We have. have you decided? Yes. Yes. Let us follow Jesus. No more turning back. Hallelujah. Yes. For it is, uh, it, 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 it is not in vain. There is a great reward. The best Amen. decision that one can Hallelujah. make. Hallelujah. And let us, when we are making decisions, let us not leave our children behind. Hallelujah. Let us have our God together with our children. Hallelujah. Oh, how wonderful and how glorious it is when the whole family is serving the Lord. Together. That is the desire of God. Hallelujah. That is the will of God. And, Amen. And there he commands blessings. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Where there is unity. We are so grateful and uh, we are yet reminding you of, of uh, the um, parenting empowerment. We are, we are really keen about this and it's a, it's a campaign we are rolling. We want parents to arise in their positions and, and be intentional mm. to bring godly children. I'm also going to request that if you are there and you can partner with us. Hallelujah. Our, our, our dream is to move from one county to another. Amen. We have begun in Kiambu, right here in Thika. Amen. And uh, we intend to really move. Yes, plan, plans, yeah, plans are also ongoing in Kirinya County, as we said. Uh, we already have a, a powerful team of about 10 pastors who are moving around and, and organizing. And for your information, these are young pastors. Some of them are not even married, but they are determined. Oh, yes. By the time they are coming to hit the road, yes. they hit the road running properly. Amen. But it is never too late. We can turn back from where we are it is and possible. we correct the rubbles. From those rubbles, God can make whole families oh, yes. in the name of Jesus Christ. Goal. He is able to do all that in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. So if you are out there and you feel you mm. want to partner with us, the doors are wide open. Oh, yes. Come in with yes. whatever you have, whatever, mm. however you are. Let us constitute these mm. meetings. Uh, those now are, are three counties uh, in row and we know we, we want uh, uh, this work to spread over in every county let us uh, put this fire burn like bushfire for our God in the Amen. name of Jesus Christ. Yes. Let there be an altar of God in every household in the name of Jesus oh, Christ yes. for the glory and honor of our Father. Right here with the Samuels, we are blessed and we are also saying you are blessed, you are blessed. in the name of yes. Jesus Christ. Yes. And from the Samuels to you, we are saying bye-bye, good night, and God bless you. Shalom, 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 shalom. We love you and we declare 